Hey folks, if you're working with mobile automation, I think you're going to love this. WebDriver.io has introduced a brand new set of mobile specific commands that make writing mobile tests significantly easier. Easier in a way that you don't need to use complex driver execute methods to do that specifically for iOS or for Android, but now in a very easy way. If you want to know more, just go to the documentation. If you go to the API documentation on the WebDriver.io documentation website and go to the mobile page, you would see all the commands that we have on the left of the menu. So why were these commands introduced? Well, here's the reasoning. Simplifying complex APIs, that was one of the re main reasons. Many Appium commands, especially those involving gestures and element interaction, require verbose and intricate syntax. The new WebDriver.io commands abstract these complexities, allowing for more concise and readable test scripts. But also one of the reasons was the cross-platform abstraction. Handling platform-specific differences between Android and iOS can be very challenging. WebDriver.io bridges the gap by providing unified commands that work consistently across platforms, reducing the need of conditional logic, but also increased productivity. You might have looked into the documentation for the Android or the iOS drivers. Well, these enhancements enable testers just to use one specific command and focus more on validating the app functionality, and thereby accelerating the development cycle. And last but not least, consistency and maintainability. Standardizing the commands lead to a uniform test script, making it easier and the code base easier to maintain and lowering the learning curve for new team members. So these enhancements are a significant step towards more accessible, readable, and maintainable mobile testing code. Well, explore the full list of commands at the WebDriver.io mobile API page and start simplifying your mobile test today.